and frustrated. School leaders promise swift change after two students are stabbed inside a Fulton County High School. It happened Wednesday at Benjamin Banneker High School in Union City. Our Rebecca Schramm live outside the school right now. And Rebecca, both the principal and Fulton County School Superintendent vowing to do something about this. Yeah, and you know what, Karen, I've been watching as Fulton County police cars are coming and going from campus. And off camera, some students are telling me they're seeing security officers on every hallway in case something else goes down. I prefer my son to be in school, but I also concerned about his safety. You can almost sense the tension at Banneker High School one day after a brawl that ended with two students being stabbed, three taken into custody and two arrested. The bloody incident was so alarming, the whole school went into lockdown and students started calling their parents. I just threw my groceries in the house and ran out the door and came up here. But I do uh, still have my concerns as a, as a dad. This father was skeptical about his daughter returning. The school handled it pretty well. So, Were you worried when you heard? Uh, once they apprehended him, I felt relief. In response to the violence, Fulton County School Superintendent Dr. Mike Looney says he's requesting to hire 10 additional campus security associates. He placed the school on restrictive movement for 48 hours. He also plans to create a task force to develop strategies and to partner with the community to address the issues that lead to disruptions at school. Banneker's principal sent a reminder to students and parents if they get word something bad is about to happen, they can submit tips anonymously through the school district's website. I have a lot of confidence in the pr principal, and so I think that he's going to do what he can to keep them safe. I think yesterday was just an incident that was kind of isolated from something that stemmed outside of school. So I think they'll do what they're supposed to do. They've been pretty good so far. About it. I just explained to her today that if you see somebody fighting, you run to the teacher in the classroom away from the fight. You never run to a fight, a no incident, because that's very dangerous. You yeah, she's right about that. I'm learning at least one of the injured students was reportedly not the intended target. I'm working to find out when the incident report will be released on this, and we'll have updates as they come in. Live in Union City, Rebecca Schramm, CBS 46 News. All right, Rebecca, thanks for the update.